Okay, hey, I'm with Rich Froney, four-time world champion CrossFitter. Rich, it's great to meet you. Nice Why don't you say hello to my friends out there. Just tell them about what you do, your routine, how you work out here. Yeah, uh, well, this is, this is my garage gym. Uh, it's Saturday night at about 7 o'clock. I've been uh, traveling the last couple days, so I'm trying to get something in, trying to get rid of the jet lag a little bit. But uh, it's pretty much where we do a lot of our stuff most of the days. So how, how, how many hours a day do you, do you work out? Uh, it just depends. Um, the last couple years... Right around anywhere from four to six hours a day. Um, not the whole time, but a lot of the time. Somewhere, sometimes up to eight to 10 hours a day. It really depends, but uh, just had a daughter. She's nine months old, so um, being a dad takes the front seat it's now. It's just keeping so. you up a little bit. Yeah, that's right. right. Yeah, yeah. the recovery part of, uh, of training is, is lacking right now, but hey, you gotta love it. You know, the Bible says bodily exercise profits little. I don't know about you, but I want anything that God says profits, and obviously Rich is capitalizing on that. But you know what else it says? It says godliness is profitable unto eternal life. That's right. And so there's two profits here. One goes on forever and ever, and one's good for this life. Now, I want that that's good for this life, but I want that that's good for this life and the next. But I'm going to ask you, yep. when the Bible says pursue godliness, mm -hmm. what, do you think, what do you think we should do? I mean, if you ha it, it, could you have a body like this? If you just laid around and just said, hey, God wants me to be strong. He wants me to have an unfit body. Do you think your body would look like <laughs> no, this? No, no, not at all. And I think that goes along with the, you know, what you're talking about, the spiritual health is you're going to have to work for it. It's not something that's just yeah. given. You've actually got to put some time into it and, and get in the word and, uh, you know, talk to God. So, But do you enjoy building up your body? Yeah, that's part, you know, more of tearing it down is really yeah, what I'm that's doing. True. And then the sleep is building it back up. But yeah, I enjoy, I love what I do. So, And you know what? It's enjoyable when you pursue godliness. Because when you pursue godliness, you know what? You see the benefits of it. Now, I work out not near as much as rich. But I enjoy working out because I love the benefits that it yields. Well, just think about the benefits when we're pursuing holiness, pursuing godliness. We get that benefit of living in that extraordinary peace. A lot of people want peace, and I want to encourage you. Don't take lightly the words when God says, Pursue holiness without which no man's going to see me. Pursue it so that you can enjoy that inward peace like Rich enjoys this great-looking body. <laughs> Rich, thanks so Appreciate much. It. It's been Appreciate a real it. pleasure being with you and your guys in here. Keep up the good work. Get some more world championships. Yeah, that's right. That's All right. right.